This video is sponsored by BetterHelp in honor of Mental Health Awareness Month. More about them at the end of the sketch. All right, man, so listen, it's ancient times, all right? Boss wants us to hide this valuable thing for him. That's, it's modern times right now. Yeah, okay, whatever, just we gotta hide this relic, okay? No, a relic is an old thing that was just made, that's brand new. Yeah, whatever. All right, it's just your perception of time sounds messed up a bit. Okay, so it's in the ground now, I buried it. Great, yeah, okay, I guess we're done then. Nobody's ever gonna find that. Yeah, 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 pretty much. Now we just gotta figure out what the riddle's gonna be and then we could get out of here. What? The riddle, you know, so somebody could track this down someday. Why would, we don't want that. That's why we're hiding this here. Well, what if hundreds of years from now an attractive adventurer wants to find the treasure? We should leave some hints. What are you talking about? Just some kind of brain teaser that'll take, you know, 90 minutes to two hours for them to fully wrap their heads around. I don't see, I have no idea why we would do something like that. Well, maybe they'll learn the true meaning of friendship along the way. We should leave a little riddle. Okay. So what I'm thinking is some kind of riddle where the answer is moon. Moon? Then we have this mechanism where when a special kind of moonlight hits a specific spot. Well, like a blood moon? Yeah, like when there's a blood moon and it hits this spot, then a trap door opens and then you can see the relic. I if I had the technological skills to build something like that, I wouldn't be burying treasure for a living. Maybe we have a wall where there's a very specifically shaped hole in it. Why? And then we have this necklace with a jewel that perfectly fits inside that shape. So we need to hire a jeweler now? Then one of the adventurers realizes, oh my god, this necklace I've been wearing this whole time that's been in my family for hundreds of years, it perfectly fits in this hole and they turn it and the wall opens up. Do you have an engineering degree? Did you get one of those? Because I don't have that. Maybe we have it be two necklaces that you turn at the same time so they learn the value of teamwork. Why are you so focused on future adventurers learning to work together? Maybe the real treasure was inside them all along. No, this is the real treasure and it's supposed to be hidden. We can't put clues and mechanisms where it pops out. Well, we'd make it a little dangerous. It wouldn't be as simple as solving a riddle and turning a thing. What are you talking about? We could put some dangers along the path, like a thing where when you step on it, it shoots arrows at you. Okay, even if we knew how to set something like that up, that's like a one-time solution. What do you mean? Who's gonna reload the arrows? I don't I guess we'd have to hire somebody. For hundreds of years, just generations of arrow reloaders. Yeah. Just for centuries, they come check if the arrows need to be reloaded. I don't know how to build generational loyalty to a task like that. Scorpions! What about them? We put a thing where if you're not pure of heart, some scorpions fall on you. What does that even mean? What is the judging criteria for that? Look, man, I just think we should have some fun with this job, you know? It's kind of boring if nobody ever finds this thing. I, I guess it's a little boring. So let's figure out some cool riddles. Maybe make a treasure map, set up some booby traps. Some what? Booby traps. That's what I thought we could call these. Why would we call them booby traps? Because hopefully some ladies will hear about how cool our setup is and they'll want to show us their, you know, treasure chests. Oh, gross. Okay, fine. I'll think of something else. Well, kid. Looks like we're finally close to finding the treasure. And we learned the value of friendship along the way. We sure did, bucko. Hey, who's that? Oh, hey guys, don't mind me. I'm just here as part of the family business. What? It's just this thing my family's been doing for centuries. We just make sure there's fresh arrows in all the titty traps. In the what? <laughs> Hi there, hello, it's me, I'm the Adstronaut. I'm out here in ad space to talk to you about better health. So hey, May is Mental Health Awareness Month and this year's theme is Together for Mental Health. I used to deal with my anxiety issues by screaming into the dark void of space. But turns out there's a better way with better help. Better help is a big advocate of access to mental health care. That's why they offer customized online therapy that includes video, phone, and live chat sessions. So you don't have to see anybody on video if you don't want to. Which works for me because my front-facing camera seems to have a personal mission to make me look unattractive. Sometimes people get scared of therapy because they think it's too expensive. But luckily BetterHelp's more affordable than traditional therapy. You can apply for financial aid during sign up and they accept HSA benefits. There's also a big old range of expertise in BetterHelp's network of over 20,000 therapists so you can get help that might not be available in your area. You just have to fill out a questionnaire to help assess your specific needs and they'll match you with a therapist in under 48 hours. I mean that's super fast. It takes longer for a pizza to be delivered. Granted I'm in outer space so that might not be a related problem. So hey, this Mental Health Awareness Month, if you or someone you know is struggling, go ahead and share BetterHelp with them. Plus, you can use my link to get 10% off your first month. Just go to betterhelp.com slash Ryan George. Okay, bye now. Okay, see what I mean? That's, that's not good. <laughs>